Hi everyone. Hey, this is a real uh, quick video about my uh, trip to a dollar store. Now, you might have seen my previous videos. I talked about using these Tamaya powders and little applicators that I tend to wear out. And I think I wear them out because, uh, let's be honest, I have the strength of 10 mile railroaders. So yeah, don't act like you're not impressed. Anyways, I wear these things out and I have the higher end brushes. You can see the plastic sticking out. And these things are costing me, the nice ones anyways, $5.50. So I was told, hey, check out the dollar store. They may have foam makeup brushes. So I was at the grocery store, which is right next door to the dollar store. Now here we have dollar trees, they're called. So I can't guarantee everyone's dollar store is like this. But sure enough, the makeup section, they had 20 foam applicators for a dollar. So I bought two packs. I'm thinking, how can you go wrong? Even if they're, even if they're not the, as good as the uh, professional foam applicators, for 20 for a dollar, can't beat that. And while I was there, I kept looking around to other stuff, and they have a big craft area. And I also picked up this uh, cutting mat for a dollar. I'm like, holy cow. I mean, it's not as thick. Like, here's my, uh, you can see the difference. And this one I bought a train show, and this one cost me around, I think, five, six dollars. And then the mat on the bottom cost me ten dollars, and that was at Walmart. But hey, you know, for a dollar, why not? And this would be great if you like if you're traveling and you go to hobby shops and your motel you want to work on your, your trains. This would be a nice little thing to take with you. And then they had a whole case of these little Mod Podge water-based sealer and glue. Now, I never used this in uh, model trains. I know a lot of guys do. I've used it for my uh, kids' school project. So I figured, you know what? I'll just buy a bottle for a dollar. Why not? Let's see how it goes. And I also bought this little mini utility box case, you know, a little storage case. And that thing clamps on. And you got uh, four spaces. And what I'm going to do with that is I bought these high speed drill bits from uh, Harbor Freight, and you know what, I cut them open to get them, but they're kind of a pain to store in here. So I'm going to uh, store these drill bits in this little container, and they had a bunch of these, and uh, that way I can easily get to them, and they're nice and secure in this little box. So, you know, not a bad little haul from a dollar store. There's five dollars worth of stuff. And they had other, they have like uh, hobby knives, which I don't know if the quality is that good, but you know what? If you're visiting an area and you didn't bring your tools and you want to work on your trains or whatever, hey, you know what? Go give them for a dollar. If they're garbage, it cost you a dollar. But there was just tons of stuff. I was surprised because I haven't been to the dollar store in ages. So, like I said, I can't guarantee you'll find this at your dollar store, but you know what? I know a lot of guys have done videos too on dollar store finds, but you know, it really isn't a bad thing to check out. All right, guys. Take care and I'll see you later. Oh, one more thing. I want to show you a hat that I got, so let me flip the uh, camera around. Yeah, one of my subscribers gave me this hat. It's the first uh, gift I've gotten from a subscriber. So I guess uh, people are starting to like me. Mm -hmm. But anyways, thanks, John. I love this hat, and if you look close, there's a uh, steam engine on it. And actually what this is from is uh, there was a baseball team in Syracuse, New York, that used to have this as their emblem or logo whatever they sent switch to the Mets but this is a wicked cool hat so once again hey John thank you I love it all right everybody thanks for watching and I'll see you later all right one more thing I know I keep saying that but okay this is the final thing once I ended the video I just made I was opening up these packages and this is really cool I just want to show you quick so you take it out of this you know sassy and chic packaging and check this out. A little folder, plastic folder for all your brushes. Yeah, I thought that was pretty cool. All right, now I'm done. All right, everyone. Have a great day. I'll catch you later. Bye.